I'm Rebecca from Pack Hacker, and in this video, we're going to be taking a detailed look at the Heim Planet Neck Pouch A5, which I've been testing now for two weeks. Check out our website for the full review. The link is in the description below. Let's dive in. Okay, so let's jump in and take a look at this thing. So this is really a handy pouch for those kind of daily essentials that you want to take with you when you're out and about. Um, so this is the A5. However, Heim Planet also does an A6, which is half the size of this one. Um, so it's a lot smaller. So if you had like fewer items that you wanted to take out, then that's really handy. Um, it's pretty much exactly the same. Uh, Feature-wise, apart from this zipper at the front, this is a YKK AquaGuard, and this is just a YKK zipper. It's got some added resistance, weather resistance on it, but it's it's different to this one. Um, so that seems to be the main difference that we've seen, other than the size, of course. And um, so it's just handy to know that there's a smaller version if that suits you know your use case better. So this has a mix of materials going on. It has Dico Shell 2 um, and there's also some ripstop nylon which you can see so if you get a hole in it, um, hopefully not, but if you do then it should stop it from ripping any further. So some nice durable materials going on here and it's also PU coated so um, it's got some added weather resistance and you know we've got these YKK zippers as well. This one is the AquaGuard one at the front um, this one isn't um, but you've also on the inside got some weather resistance going on in there too um, which is just you know nice addition just one less thing to worry about so you've got the main compartment um, at the back so this is the biggest um, compartment and I'll open it up for you to check out it's just a, a big bucket basically where you can just dump all of your stuff so if you like a bit more organization then using something you know smaller pouches and things to organize your items is handy um, for this one and also you can see there's some nice uh, zipper pulls on here so just make it really easy to pull across and um, I've got a nice bit of branding on there as well Heim Planet branding here and of course we've got the logo on the front as well and this is reflective which is handy if you know you like to go on a hike or cycling things like that um, it's always nice and you've got the added bit of color there it just adds a nice little touch doesn't it um, so yeah this is just a big compartment you can put all of your stuff and then on front Heim Planet calls this the hover pocket so the reason it's there it's got its own dedicated volume so it lets you pack out both of these compartments fully without them getting in each other's way so you're not going to start eating you've got like this much space to eat up you know when you pack that full so it's nice to know that you know you can get the full use out of both of these compartments and it's a really nice little feature going on there i will say there's been a couple of times and i've just missed you know when i first started testing this that i mistook it for just the, one of those sleeve pockets and you think oh no that's going to fall straight through um just when you're in a rush and you quickly go to just pop something in it um, so just be aware of that, it's not an issue, you just have to get used to it. Uh, but you can, Heimplant also says we haven't tried this ourselves, but you can, if you know, you're out hiking and you want to take your jumper off, you can just use it and slot it through there and carry it that way. Um, so it's got a couple of different uses there, which is really nice. Um, so you can also fit a surprising amount of items inside, which, you know, relates back to this hover pocket as well, where it's just sewn on at the sides, because you know, you, like I said, you can make full use of all of that space going on there, which is really nice. And um, so another great thing about this is the strap. So it's fully adjustable and you've also got this magnetic closure here, uh, which is lovely to use. You have, let me just pull that out. Um, here you've got a little loop and a strap keeper to keep it all looking nice and tidy so when you tighten it up there we go no dangling nice dangle free experience there which is always nice and as you I'm not sure if you can see but it's also got like that shiny kind of glossy texture 
and so far we've had no issues with it pilling on our clothes or anything like that so um, really nice and that smoothness just helps to adjust it really easily but you know it doesn't slip out when you're wearing it either which is nice and it's just a pleasure to kind of use you know there's you know it's so annoying when you have those straps that are difficult to adjust and you've got a dangling strap hanging everywhere so you can you know have it whatever size you want if you want it loose or you want it tight around you and it works really well so and like I said you can also nice and easy adjust it there but as you've probably noticed we've also got these aluminum clips here which really easy again to take off and so this just means that you can use it as a standalone product as well if you just want to use it as a tech pouch in your day pack or in your travel bag then you can just take those off it's up to you if you want to use them pop them inside or leave them and you can just carry this in your bag as well um i've also i've done this quite a lot with this the smaller um a6 version for like those kind of smaller items in my day pack really kind of nice to use take these off pop that inside and then I can just grab it out if I need to so really handy feature there that I've used quite a lot um, and then in this front compartment I'll just show you the same kind of space again really nice for those quick uh, those items that you want to grab really quickly out and it's yeah it just works really well this is like a bigger bucket compartment so like I said that extra organization you know through pouches and things like that is handy if you want to keep track of all your stuff um, I just want to show you one more thing that I noticed. Um, as you've probably seen, this bag doesn't have a lot of structure. So when you are, you know, out and about and you're carrying it, when it's on, I can just show you slightly, give you an idea, it does crease. So unless you're carrying something like a book that's going to structure that right out, it doesn't go completely flat unless it's fully packed out. You're going to have some kind of dip in and sag in the middle where just that lack of structure is basically so and just another thing to be aware of there however um, a good thing about the lack of structure is that it's super lightweight and I'll leave that just take these out so that you can just see that when everything is taken out super lightweight and it just packs really flat so if you're carrying like fewer items it just goes you know against your body really easily or you know if you're a fan of one bag travel and you want to pop that in your travel bag as your sling then it's going to take up hardly any space or weight um, and just a really handy sling to have around so there you have it there's the high and planet neck pouch a5 Check out packhacker.com for more information and the best buying options that help support the channel at no additional cost to you. Link down below. We'll see you in the next video.